here and kiss me. Kiss you? <laughs> you just made me promise not to get involved. We didn't shake on it. Right, and I had my fingers crossed all the time. Oh, this is... <laughs> Oh, Taxi. Oh, my God, Taxi. Okay. Well, Taxi was like my first three-camera sitcom that I ever did. And um, oh, the director, Jimmy Burroughs, that all, directed all of them. Well, he was sick or something. And the producer was directing this episode, and he came up to me and said, D just do good and get me through this episode. I'm going, holy shit, I can't get anybody through anything. I don't know what I'm doing. And I remember calling my agent in tears the second day going, they've rewritten everything. Everything's different. And he's going, okay, D, don't worry. That's what they do on a sitcom. That's what they do. It'll all be okay by the time you tape. But I, I, I can't remember it if they keep changing everything. And one time, oh, I love Jed Hirsch. What a great guy. And we're rehearsing this thing, and they've got me, they, they want me to do this fall over the couch and this pratfall and everything. And I'm going, no, no, that, it's, A, I don't know how to do that, but that's not, that's not the character. It's not, and, and he said, well, well, somebody's got to do it. And I said, well, you do it. And he went, okay, I'll do it. <laughs> so, <laughs> but by the time we were finished with that app, the chemistry between Jed and I was so amazing that it was one of their top episodes. Have you ever worked together again? No, and I would love to. I would love to work with him. He was just, uh, again total pro, you know, and he knew, everybody in the set knew that here was this virgin, really, actress, had talent, but we got to help her get through this week. But I always, one thing I'll say for myself is I, if it's not right, literally, as the character, I can't do it. I can't just go, okay, well, whatever. I, I just can't. <laughs>